We stand here when we take three steps forward and we stand here when we get knocked five steps back. And I have to tell you what, looking around the room today at all of my LGBT colleagues, at our straight allies, all of the folks who have made this movement such a success, I have to thank you. Because if it weren't for you, we wouldn't have made the successes and had the victories that we've had over the last year. So give yourself a round of applause. excited to be here tonight because I am standing here and talking about a woman that I have been excited about being our next president of the United States for over eight years now. Yeah. And I have spent a significant amount of time in the trenches in both Jefferson City and now here locally and I can tell you that it takes a woman of this magnitude, of this intellect and this character to make a difference and this is the woman who is the most qualified person we have ever had to run for President of the United States, hands down, ever, period. You have heard me say over and over and over again that if you don't have a seat at the table, you're probably on the menu. <laughs> Hillary Clinton is not LGBT. QIA or any other. Hillary Clinton is our ally. Hillary Clinton knows that our rights are human rights. Yes. She knows that women's rights are human rights. Right, yeah. She knows that the least among us are the most important and that is the woman who is going to go to Washington DC. She is actually going to be able to navigate her way through that hellhole and she is going to be able to make a difference for this country. And so what I have to ask you tonight, this is a hard ask because I can stand up here and I can ask for your money and I can ask for all these other things, but you have got to give us your time. We have 19 days left. What do we lose, or what do we win Iowa by? 0.2%? 0.2%. We have to have every single vote. Every single one of your votes counts. So first of all, first and foremost, what are you gonna do on March 15th? When are the polls open? Seven. 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 Six. Six. Seven a.m. till six p.m. Okay. You have to go to the polls and vote. None of this matters if you don't show up. Third, I need you to absolutely make sure that you volunteer for this campaign because every phone call you make, every penny you give, every door you knock on is going to make all the difference in the world. And then when we win on March the 15th, oh, yeah. Yeah. next morning on March the 16th and I need you to get back to work <laughs> because we cannot stop until Hillary Rodham Clinton is the next president of the United States.